What's going on guys, Rodrigo here, Breakfast Club CTG. We'll be back in this speed. Today's gonna be a nice and quick one followed by a workout or a workout followed by a quick review. Today we're going over the Virus International CO23 Stay Cool Compression V3 Tech Short. Let's go ahead and get into the video. Alright guys, so first off, all I'm gonna say is quality. The first thing that describes this particular pair of shorts is quality. Next, performance and comfort. Like literally the quality is insane. The performance, which is this is like a performance-based company, they knock it out of the park, and then comfortability, it's insane. Literally, I always have to have something that looks good, that feels good, and that performs good. This passes all three tests. Right off the bat, you got this like nice virus logo that's like i don't even know it's not like screen print it's like a metallic chrome print right there with virus then over here you got that same metallic print along here but it's almost like a super tight stretchy material doesn't feel like it's gonna crack doesn't feel like it's gonna fade or anything you got the virus logo there you got the virus writing going down the bottom honestly guys it looks great right boom second of all they build these shorts for people in action sports functional fitness fighting mma all sorts of things so performance is huge for them they do that amazingly well next comfort usually whenever you think of performance and like quality fabrics and this and that it might not be the most comfortable you think of something that looks good and that's stylish it's also not the most comfortable this looks good it performs great and the comfort is next level guys i'm not even just saying that this video is going to be going up before for my other video where I put these shorts to the test. I'm going over a few of their products and literally I'm blown away at the comfort of this stuff. The quality and then just the looks of it. Anyway, the comfort of this stuff is amazing. So these shorts in particular were designed to be nice and tight. Compression shorts, obviously, you can wear them just the short put them under your short as a base layer, etc. They're gonna make you feel cool. They're gonna keep you nice and tight and compressed and also they're gonna help you perform. So right off the bat, if it's a nice hot summer day, like it has been these last few days testing these shorts out, sweat and everything has never been an issue. They don't feel like too sticky, they don't feel uncomfortable and start to itch or like they start to climb up on you. They literally stay in place. They keep you nice and tight and compressed. During your lifts, you feel nice and good, feel nice and tight, you feel good. As you get going and the sweat starts dripping, I don't know about you guys, but I literally can can almost wring my clothes out after I get done working out. The sweat literally just absorbs it. It doesn't feel uncomfortable, yet it also doesn't smell or anything like that. And also, it just keeps you cool. Like, not once did I feel I couldn't breathe in these. Like, the material's super breathable. It helped me stay cool the whole time. And honestly, they just were super comfortable the entire time. Not once was I feeling like I couldn't wait to get out of these shorts. Or honestly, I can lounge around and chill in these, like, the whole day. That's how comfortable they are. So, 
those three things, that's what they were designed to do, to keep you cool, to help you perform, and to stay nice and tight and compressed. So, like I said, you can use these for functional fitness, MMA, whatever you guys want to do. They have this nice little drawstring here, which is also next level. On the inside, they have these little rivet in here to keep that little drawstring in there, and the drawstring goes around the waistband there. The waistband's super high quality. That's something I always live for in shorts, because sometimes they're flimsy. They kind of start to wear out over time. They start to bunch up and just get all weird. This little waistband is super small and thin, but like heavy duty and reinforced. The material is super high quality. It's nice and tight, and the shorts aren't crazy, like crazy hard to put on or anything like that. But once they're on, they fit like a glove to your body. They're nice and tight. They're nice and comfortable, guys. They're nice and breathable, too, so they're comfortable. So that's awesome guys. So the fabric is their specialty. I don't know if it's patented or they own the rights to it or whatever, but it's called the Cool Jade Fabric. That's the material that's inside the shorts that keeps you nice and cool and compressed. This particular pair of shorts is nine and a half inch inseam, seven and a half inch out seam, and the little waistband is reinforced. Like I said, I'm around 5'5", five, 5'6", five, five, on a good day, 140 pounds. I'm wearing a size small. It fits good. It doesn't feel overly tight, but it doesn't feel overly loose. It literally, between overly tight and overly loose, I'm like right below half of like I'm right in the middle of that a little bit less than in the middle so they fit nice and tight but not crazy tight and they don't feel crazy loose or anything like that so just to give you guys a reference point if you guys are looking at these shorts I highly highly recommend them guys just to be real and get things straight with you guys I would never recommend something that I personally wouldn't buy or that I personally would never spend my hard-earned money on that I don't believe in or that I don't think is quality so that's why I'm making this video on these shorts I'm not getting paid by them I'm not affiliated with them in any way guys as you guys saw my previous videos of other clothes and stuff I'm just showing you guys what I like, what it's helped me and what helps me, you know, perform and stuff that I like, especially for functional fitness and just living an active lifestyle. So that's why I'm showing you guys these shorts and recommending them to you. Stay tuned for another video where I go over a haul that I got from Virus and also we put the shorts to the test. We do a bunch of different things, mountain biking, hiking, rucking, functional fitness, bodybuilding style stuff, and a few different pieces of their clothing. So stay tuned for that, guys. Again, guys, one huge, huge thing that I always look at in shorts, whether they're underwear, compression shorts, or just regular shorts, is that they're not going to get in the way of my leg especially like my knees they're not gonna get caught on my knees they're not gonna get caught on my quads right here and they don't do that they literally fit you to your body like a glove they move with you not once that they get in the way they feel amazing and I think that's because of the seven and a half inch inseam that seems to be like the magic money number for the inseams that I like to wear because it's right above the knee like right on the quad honestly a six and a half is like good a five is a little too short for my liking that's kind of like the running style shorts that people like to wear those super super short ones like Nick Bear if you guys know who he is that guy is on the level with his short shorts. I'm doing a day in the life of Nick Bear, and honestly, the hardest part of that video hasn't been the waking up early. It hasn't been the eating or the lifting or the running. It's been wearing the short shorts out in public. So, I mean, I thought I liked wearing wear short shorts, but this guy takes it to a whole nother level. Anyways, that's a topic for another video. Stay tuned. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button if you guys want to see that, and if you guys want to see more of this stuff. As always, Breakfast Club CTG, we have this B. I'm gonna fly right back.